black widow spider is one of the most famous spiders in the whole world because people know that it's really venomous. And the black widow isn't just a single species, it's actually a whole family of spiders. And they can be found in North America, South America, Europe, and Africa, and pretty much all over the world. So here we have the black widow. The scientific name is Latrodectus mactans, and it's the southern black widow found in the United States. And it weaves a really irregular web, so it's not gonna have a nice pattern like most spider webs. They sort of just have these cobwebs all over the place. And what they'll do usually is they'll hang upside down and display the red hourglass marking on their abdomen as a warning signal. Most people are afraid of this spider because they think that a bite is going to kill you. But actually, you're only really in danger if you're really old or really young because most people have an immune system which can fight off the venom. And if you do get bitten, you're going to have a really sore and swollen bite wound. You'll have muscle cramping, some nausea, um, an increased heart rate, but this spider isn't really going to kill you. This video clip is showing the black widow walking on my hand. I don't recommend handling them because you can never be 100% certain how an animal is going to behave. But the main idea here is that the black widow spider won't bite you unless they feel threatened. And a common example of someone getting bit is if it's in your shoe and you put your foot inside, it's going to bite because it's trapped. But if it's just walking on my hand like this and not being aggravated, it doesn't feel the need to defend itself. These black widow spiders are a good example of gender dimorphism because the males and the females will look different. So the females of the species, they have this typical shape of a black body with the red markings on the abdomen. And the males, they're about one third of the size and they're more brownish and they have different patterns on their body. Black widows are named widows because it was a popular idea that they eat the male spiders after mating. And it was thought that this is a survival strategy so the female has enough energy to lay the eggs and develop the eggs. But this behavior isn't actually common. The cannibalistic behavior only really happened in captivity, and the likely reason is if they were kept in an aquarium, the male would have nowhere else to run, and it can't get away, and that's when the female would eat it. But in the wild, usually the male will just walk away after mating, and they're not going to cannibalize each other.